How can something as beautiful as this be dying? A plague is ruining the land, but the tree of life still stands. Question is, for how long? End is coming to the new world. The tribes stand divided, in need of someone strong enough to unite them, or bring them all down. This is a story with an unusual beginning. So, let's expect an unusual end. Oh, all right. Everyone, welcome to Bio Mutants. And uh, I'm just gonna remove that really quick. Welcome to Bio Mutants, and of course, you see on the screen. I'm playing on the Xbox, of course, you know, your boy is an Xbox fan, you know, it's not really much people really like it, but, wow, that was an awesome intro, alright. Welcome to Biomutant. Yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and get in this. We're going, to, we're going to stick with medium on this. Let me. Encode your DNA. All right, so we got primal. We got doom. We got Rex, a Rex that's looking kind of fly. We got Hyla. We got Flip and Mugal. Well, I want to go with Rex. Is he looks awesome, and he's like a perfect character for me. So, go to next. Okay. Define your genetic structure. There we go. Choose a genetic resilience. Ooh. Feel like I feel like that because choose your first style. Ooh. We go a little bit brown. What's this? A little bit gray. I think we're gonna go with this type of look. Looking pretty good. Pick your main color. My main? Your boy's all about that blue. Yeah, let's go a little bit up more. Yeah, 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 there. Now we gotta go a little bit darker. Yeah, we're gonna have. We can't have too light. We can't have too dark. About right there. Choose your detail.
Uh, about right there. That's pretty good. That's looking pretty good. good. Klaus. Dead Eye. Commando. Commando. Yeah, pretty fancy. Sci Freak. Saboteur. Sentinel. Uh. Sabot Psy Freak Commando I'm going to go with Commando Commando chosen Sounds good Yep Alright That's how you move Basically. Here's somebody with a troubled past, drawn into the spotlight of a story that's already begun. We're already at a crossroads. Choosing a path in life is that fork in the road where you make a choice or simply stop living. Okay. So... But for you, it's not only a crossroad, but a choice. A reflection of your key, the primal energy that flows through everything. Hmm. Do you want to be light or do you want to be dark? Let me introduce myself. I'm the light and bright side of you, or your inner voice to be precise. An echo of balance and consequence of your actions as you move forward. Right. Seems more like you're being lightheaded if you ask me, but you'll come around eventually. Uh, I'd rather be light. But what comes around goes all the way back around. So it's better to stick to your instincts. You can't fight what's in your nature. Yeah, well. In your nature, and here I was hoping we'd be all about natural selection, survival of the strongest, and so forth. Now, if that's not instinct, then I don't know what is. Natural selection is all about evolution and progress, and as soon as there's enough light, darkness will disappear. Hmm. You know what? You two, I like like a couple. Sheesh. Okay. Do I want to go left or do I want to go right? And let's just go right. Right is always right. Probably seeing all stories of death and the bodies left behind. A reminder that we're the mercy of nature and the one that preys on others. Yes, we know. Do you remember the beast that shattered your family? Or did you choose to forget? You turned your back on our world and got lost in your own. Meanwhile, mm. the predator only grew hey stronger. Guys. Oh, snap. Okay. Nice. 
No, you don't. Ouch. And come on. What is that? Get that off of me. Well, that did not happen. I didn't try to jump at him. Better make a run for it. Uh, this is yep. not the time nor place to end this story. I didn't even try, try to like jump into him and try to break his stick, but apparently I did. So I guess that's what I get, you know. But the reason I chose range is because I like to keep my distance. This time it was best to run and live to fight another day. Let us hope you're ready for it when it comes. Oh, snap. Done, bro. Okay. The predator isn't the only threat. The wildlife started to mutate when the end of days began, and the tree of life started to die. All right. Ow. Come on. Come on. I'm fast. Fast. Come on. Come on. Well placed. I'm going to get you. I'm going to click your skin. I'm going to click all oh, y'all. Flash the slash. Hey, yeah. You know what? I had enough. No more missing nice guy. Yeah. I know we're supposed to go that way, but uh, I wanted to explore. A little bit. See what they got. A bunch of nothing. All right. All right, you guys. Let's continue forward. What I got. Okay. <laughs> you just take it. Um, just, just take it all. All right. I know I got interact with that, but ooh, what's going on here? Am I supposed to be here? I feel like I'm not supposed to be here. Am I? Uh, let's just go back down.
Actually, I never went back down here. That was just a mistake. Alright. The oil sludges everywhere. To most, it only means death. But some have adapted to the new environment changed with it. Evolution has its ways. Ouch. How am I supposed to parry? Ouch. you got okay I'll take all of that all right let's continue forward oh my gosh today we're good we're good yeah now give me what you got okay Let's continue on forward. So I guess humans used to live here. I'm guessing that was the case. That humans used to live here. I don't know if they used to live here. But they probably did. Seems like I go hand to hand. Ouch. What's good? That's what's good. I broke your ankles. Y'all didn't see anything. I didn't get my butt whoop. What's up?
upgrade bonus. Okay. We're gonna have to check that out. Uh, nope, that's the man. Yeah. I guess this. Okay. Um. I think I want. Grin and bear it. Yeah. What's this? Um, Ooh. Okay. B B X R T okay B X R T box from the once was a rare sign up okay yeah humans us humans has to been here before anyone else oh that's nice should come in handy. There we go. Whoa. Okay. It's time to find a way out of this place. No, really, I mean it. So I guess I guess humans created us. And then And then, like, like, they also created these robots, and then, you know, I guess we took over the area, but I don't know where the other humans might be. This might be us. We mutated into this. So, we don't know. It could be a whole bunch of questions and uh, questions the morks produce biomass in their multi that they shed under distress blobs that affect the cellular coding strands of any living being when absorbed including you B X Come on B X Get off me Go. 
Can I destroy this? Apparently not. Okay. Oh. See, look, look at that. They say I'm in the info, but yeah, but like, look at that. Toxin all built vessels called arcs to save themselves from the impending doom. But was it too late? It is only from the flight logs of the single arc they left behind that we know other arcs traveled through the sky and beyond. It seems those that came before us never lost hope in finding a new home for their kind. Toxinol built oh, vessels no. No. called oh, arcs to save themselves from the impending doom. But What's this? Okay. What I gotta do? Switch knots and select LB, LRB to rotate. Okay. All right. So. Oh. Just a few moves left. Make them count. What do you mean, just a few moves left? <gasps> oh! Okay, I get it. Okay. Wait. Is it not there? Okay. Oh, I have a couple moves left. Is that that it? Am I? Okay, so that's yellow. There we go. Ah, uh, okay. So you guys gotta mash it together. Okay. There are few records of the chain of events that led to the big apocalypse eons ago, but it's clear the world wasn't prepared for how recklessly the Toxinol Corporation would make its mark on the world. Their rare earth mining and nuclear industries generated tons of waste and, without consideration for the future, they dumped it all in landfills until they ran out of space. That's when they made the big mistake. They began dumping the toxic waste in the surf just off the coast instead, assuming that it would sink and decay with time. And they were right. But no one was prepared for what was about to unfold. Once in the surf, the radiation interfered with the genetics of the wildlife and created bizarre mutations in their offspring. It had an inconceivable impact on biodiversity and the entire ecosystem. The world as they knew it crumbled as nature retaliated. It would never be the same again, and what remained of it became ours okay so like like I was saying uh, we did this we did all of this and and we I guess we tried to fix it I guess but it was already too late so the sound of spark metal going pew pew is never a good thing 
It's coming from behind that door. A warning label. The box looks like a potential brain melt. It's going to take a bit of puzzling to short circuit the door. Well. Well. There you go. That was easy. If you guys haven't, uh, go watch my Five Nights at Freddy's. It is in there on the YouTube. And check out the playlist as well. So you don't miss anything on the Five Nights at Freddy's. And if you guys enjoy this, please like and subscribe this before we talk to this person. You got five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, good job. All right, let's continue. The wheeled one is outnumbered. You'd better help him out. Me, X. The last of them. Let's hey. talk to the wheeled one before backup arrives. Um. Yeah, I got. I gotta collect these. This is gonna be really important. What you got? All right, I'll take them. I'll take this. Yeah, I'll take that. All right. Let's continue on. Close that door. What's up? Vunko Vuntu. He wants to thank you for taking his side against the scavengers. He sounds familiar. You just can't figure out why. He presents himself as out of date. He knows he's way overdue, but he hasn't given up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that leg's overdue. I'm surprised that you don't recognize him. You were just a child back then. The night everything changed. There have been rumors of a one eyed Ronin seen outside the Great Wall, and he's happy to see it's true. Uh. The legend of the one-eyed child that grew up as an outcast is old and sad. The child could have been anyone, but the evil it had fled had left a mark, a facial scar to remember the past. Okay. There's no doubt you're the child, and that what Lupa Lupin did to your village, your Mooma and Popsy, was the beginning of the Popsy. end. He says it has taken you a long time to bring the past back up to the present to find your way back, but he's grateful you have. Come, Reaper. It was after the attack 
that the unity fell apart. Your Muma's disciples divided and formed tribes as a reaction to the blight that had fallen upon the land. Uh -huh. Had it not been for the Tree of Life, no one would have survived. He hopes you at least remember the tree. So, I guess our mom and dad are still alive. And when this all, like, you know, went bad, they separated into a tribe and, I guess, fighting each other. Okay. Well, uh, well, I was going to save it here. Well, um, well, I guess I'm just going to leave it off right here. I, uh, I'm just going to leave it here. And do the rest tomorrow. But um, the story, the story is good. We got into it. We got a piece of the story of like why, what happened, and why it happens. We figured out the puzzle is just a matchmaking, so that's that's going to be easy until like in the little bit in the gameplay we get into it's going to get a little bit more harder but um besides that uh yeah i want to leave this here uh hope you guys enjoyed this video uh please make sure that you like subscribe and hit that bell icon so you'll be notified when i post a video and I will see all of you in the next one. Bye.